OK, digital business cards. Have you got one? No more paper, no more card, no more damaging the planet. No, it's got to be digital these days. Right. Um, there's a few ways of doing these. Actually, I was a bit hesitant to make this because a guy, a friend of mine, I know actually has a company that makes the uh, real cards and they have a chip in them or whatever they have in them. So you can just tap them on your phone and um, it saves the client's details or it saves your details to your client or your potential customer. Um, I will actually try and get a link so I can post that so you can have a look at his cards. Hayden, what's your link? But these are actually something a bit different. It's a business card generator, so you can make a card and then you can share it via, via QR code or via a link. Um, there's a link in the description talking about links, so you can get this for a great deal. Uh, check that out. And here we go with a Smart V card, although it looks like Smart TV card. <laughs> I'll show you what I mean. Right, here we go. Uh, here is uh, the digital card generator. I'll just run through this really quickly and show you how easy it is. I'm not going to make these good. I was playing around before, so you just very, very quickly, you upload your business logo, I'm just, I had it before. Now I'm trying to find it. I won't be able to find it, will I? But you upload any old business logo. OK. And then you upload your headshot. So here we go. Let's see if I can get it from that. It might work. Let's see. Oh, no. Can I just about ooh, crop it? <laughs> Cheesy pick. Am I in there just about? Uh, that'll do. I had to pause the video there because it was flashing up. Not that I'm really bothered, but it was flashing up all my real, real details. I'm not saying I'm a man of mystery, but, uh, you know, it was putting out, it was putting up my address and everything. But anyway, so, fill software. Uh, and. Oh, no, Mr. Mr. <laughs> Mr. Phil. So Hello, I'm Mr. Phil Software. Uh, me pronouns. It's 2023. Have I got pronouns? I wouldn't know what mine are. Here's. Him. Have you ever thought about your... Listen, I've got to be... Yeah. Uh, me title, software. Review. Uh, and other stuff, if you're watching anything. <laughs> Phil, this is getting boring. Sorry. Reviews. Software. So your address. Software. Street. And then a bit of blurb about yourself. Uh, I review... Um, right, I'm just showing you quickly, sorry. Uh, right, so then you can add other actions onto your cards. So what do you want them to do? You want them to, well, I've just got a mobile these days. Just go to your mobile. So, uh, plus four, four, seven, 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 seven. Okay, so you can add in mobile, fax machine, uh, messenger, WhatsApp, email. All right, what else can you add? So these are primary actions. Skype, maybe your website address. Is that on a web address? Yeah, your store ID. So whatever you want to add to your primary, you can basically add what you want onto it, okay? Uh, and then you can add your secondary actions, which are your, your socials. So you can add your Facebook with your page name, your PayPal, whatever you want to add there. Your secondary actions you can add into it. Then you can feature some content. So I could add, what could I add? A bit of text. This is, oh no, what have I done? Don't you hate it when that happens? <sighs> Pause the video while I start again. I could be bothered starting again. Oh, isn't it annoying when that happens anyway? Yeah, it completely wiped it out. I'm not blaming that company. It happens all the time, doesn't it? That's the most annoying thing in the world, I think. Uh, after death. <laughs> Oh, number it again. I'm not doing it all again. Seven, six. Yeah, yeah. That That is the most annoying thing when you've written something or you've done something and then you lose it all. It kills you. Yeah, secondary actions, Facebook. So you add all of that in, basically, and you create your nice pretty card, which isn't as pretty as before. Um, now, I don't think because I'm on the full paid version on this um, that you can. So customize the footer credit. No, thanks. Uh Simplify your visible card. No, thanks. Customize your favicon. So you can do all this stuff. Customize your metadata. Search engine uh, visibility. You can encourage or discourage it. You might just want it to be private. Then you can change your body background. Let's have a look. Oh, yeah. So you can just change it. Make it look like your business. Uh, and then when you've done all that, you can... Right, I've not decided where I want to host mine now. And then once you've connected your made your business card, 
I have not touched that will cause any link. I have verified all the links are working correctly. I have removed all that. Uh, and you can download your business card as a zip. Now, I'm pretty sure. Just let me pause the video. I'm back. Okay, so yeah, you can download it and host it yourself. So once you've, I'm going to download it as a zip. Uh, I've done all that, done all that, done all that, done all that. Oh, no, I've lost it again. <laughs> Sorry about that. Great video, this one. Download it with Google. So I can download my card. This isn't going to say. I've literally, because I went forward and back now, it saved it as a blank card, annoyingly. All right, so I've got me, I've got me card there. Let's show it in the folder. Let's open it up. Um, there is my blank card. But there it is. All right, that would have been my full card. So let's keep this. I'm not gonna. This is gonna be an annoying video, and you can write to, to YouTube and complain. So you've made your business card. You download it. Um, to a zip file, and then you could host that business card on your website, okay? And then you could share it by telling people to scan the QR code, and if they do scan that on their phone, they will be able to save that business card and the details to their phone, okay? Oh, I'm smiling today. Or the other option is they can host a business card for you. So once you've downloaded it, you can host it. Look at this on their domain and you download it and you simply re-upload it again and it has 30 days free and it's $20 a year to host it on their domain. All right, I think this is actually more designed for kind of agencies to use, you know, as a service they can offer. So, you know, you're selling a website to a customer or a business you could offer that you can make all of the company's employees digital business cards that you will upload onto their website. I actually think that is the real use of it. All right, I think I'm going to jump out now and feel a bit bad. Um, the reason that we've not got a great business card to show is because I went forward and backward and it kept on wiping it off, and that's not my fault. Um, but, yeah, once you've got your business card, you make it look pretty, uh, you add everything onto it with your picture, uh, you download it as a zip file, you can host it on your website or host it anywhere, or you can host it with them, and then once it is hosted and it is up there, you can basically copy that QR code, you could keep that on your phone, say, do you want my business card? They could scan that and save it, all right? I'm not sure, I'm being honest, if that's got real, I don't know, has that got use in the world today? Um, I don't know. I'm not saying it doesn't, maybe you've been looking for a solution like that. I can't see myself using that, can you? I can see myself just sending someone my number. Or, but it's all right. Listen, that might that might be very useful. Is all I'm saying. Uh, I'll have to have a look. Yeah, my mate Hayden, he's got a company, and and they they basically make real business cards. They're that popular. I don't know the name, but they're doing very well. You know, they've got some big clients. So yeah, um, I'll try and find the link for him as well. And if you want actual real cars with chips in, uh, you could contact his company and get in touch with them. Cheers, everyone. There's my uh, review of Smart V Card. Jury's out on that one, but hey, I try and be transparent. See you soon, everyone.